Susan Shea. Hi, all you gamers out there! Zenshi here! And today, I am reacting to Poochie and Pansy remastered. But apparently it's just the first episode? I don't know if there's gonna be future episodes or what. But, uh, yeah, so apparently Poochie and Pansy has been hd -ified? I don't know! We'll, we'll just have to see. This is episode one, the, the quest, quest for the Midnight, midnight crown. crown. Um, I mean, I remember this series pretty well because I, I just reacted to like the whole series not that long ago. So uh, let's see what this new remastered version is like. I wonder if it's gonna be creepier or what? I don't know. Let's just jump right in. You guys just sit back and relax. So let's watch on. Let's do this. Let's watch Poochie and Pansy. Yeah. Okay, so first uh, first thing I noticed, I have enlarged the video. The first thing I noticed is Poochie and Pansy actually have little dog houses. And it's kind of weird because I see that they say H33, the red one does, and H54. I, I'm not sure what that means, but I have a feeling it means something like uh, deep and hidden and secret, I don't know. And there's a, uh, uh, what it, what was that? Suffer um, Dark. God, Suffer Dark. Suffer Dark or whatever. I think this is supposed to be Suffer Dark. <gasps> we'll have to see. So it looks like the original creator made this. I'm pretty sure. Uh, all credit goes to them. I'm, I'm, uh, for the video, I mean. Um, so let's see. I'm not stalling or anything. Let's, uh, let's play Poochie and Pansy. Hello? Oh! The lovely music. Poochie and Pansy. Oh, my favorite show. Hello? Part one, the quest for the Midnight Crown. Let's see it. Ooh, it is pretty nice. It's nice and clear and crisp. Once upon a time, there were two puppies named Poochie and Pansy. Oh, Pansy and Poochie. Poochie and Pansy were best oh, friends and always hung out together. They always hung out One together. Day, Poochie had something very important to tell Pansy. Is the voices re-recorded? Re hey, Pansy, guess what? Oh. What, Poochie? I'm really I a, a really weird demon. dream last night. Oh, I had one too. About the what crown. Was it, about, it was about a kitten. He was oh, locked in a tower, the and an evil witch was trying to use him to find oh, something the called the Midnight, Midnight Crown. Wow, Poochie, I had the same dream. That Me means too. It must be real. That and means it must, it must be real. It's a dream message. Well, you know what that means. Uh -oh, yeah, we gotta dark. go rescue the kitten. But where do we look? Oh wow! The tower is in Suffer Dark, where all the evil witches live. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, you're probably right. In HD. Suffer Dark is through Batwing uh -oh. Cave. Uh oh. Well, come on. Let's head to Batwing Cave. And I... so they went to Batwing oh, Cave. Oh, here they go. I mean, it looks oh, a lot better. Looks spooky in there. <gasps> oh yeah, no! Here's the jump scare. Look, I think I see Freddy the Firefly. Uh oh. Hey, hey Pansy, it's me, ah, Freddy. I thought you guys could use my me. help. Let me show you the way to Suffer Dark. Oh, wait, where's the? What happened? Where's the skull with the chicken skin? <laughs> what? What is this? It's like a skull that's been covered with like, like. What? It looks like chicken skin or something. Like what? To be continued. Directed by Rob David Yamaguchi. Story and screenplay by Rob Dulce. I remember that Dulce Entertainment or whatever. Kevin McLeod. Leon San Salvador. This has been a Dream Exxon production. 2019? Hello? Oh no! Hello? Oh. Wait, that's it? Oh my gosh, there was no jump scare! What? Is this real? Oh, oh my gosh, I bet this is like trying to mess with your mind and be like, oh, the Poochie and Pansy series, that was never real, you were all imagining it. What the heck? I'm gonna read the description. Uh, let's see, Dream Axum, I'm not sure how to say that, presents the 10th anniversary remastered edition of Poochie and Pansy. Like, like, I'm not trying to be mean, but that wasn't really like HD. I mean, it was clearer, I guess, but... I mean, it wasn't really like 
it's, I mean, I feel like HD would have been like everything was like all hand drawn and moving really nicely. I, I don't know, it was cute, but it was pretty much like the original. Uh, let's see. Uh, the remastered edition of Poochie and Pansy debut episode. Great care was taken by our creative team in Microsoft Paint to improve and refine its renewed appear experience. Experience. While retaining the charm and flavor of the original work. Please visit DreamMaxium, DreamMaxium.com to learn more about this project. Oh no. There's gonna, there's gonna be a virus on the screen or something. I want to I want to click it but I'm afraid there's going to be a jump scare. Hello? Oh, not secure. I knew it is not secure. COVID-19 update. We are Dream Axiom. It's actually a site. What the heck? Uh we strive to bring dreams to reality. You mean nightmares? Uh we believe that no dream is too simple or small. I'm afraid something's going to pop out. Um too big or outlandish. Oh, wait, is the background shaking? I swear the background is shaking or moving or something. Oh, this is creepy. Oh, the the flag is moving. I thought this was a, a still image, but it's actually a video, I think. Uh, or a GIF or something. Not a GIF, I guess. If it was a GIF, it'd be really stretched out. Okay, let's see. Uh, where was I? Uh, we... It is our conviction that every dream that aims to enrich people's lives reduce suffering in Suffer Dark or make <gasps> any Oh I shook the background shaking corner of the world a little happier it's worth fighting for. We are ambassadors is that spelled wrong? I don't know. Of lying in meadows and staring at clouds with black holes for eyes. We are advocates for cut and paste projects with our kids. We are crusaders for welders, sculptors, actors, singers, violinists out of all of the instruments, uh, costumers, customer, customers or costumers, and anyone who craft, whose craft is art. Uh, we know you have something to say. We can help you say it. What? And there's actually like a telephone number and stuff? This can't be real. Why? Oh, what the heck? What? This background is weird. I, I guess, I, I'm guessing this is supposed to be like Dream a Axiom headquarters or whatever, but it's kind of in a weird location. I wonder what that says. I can't quite make that out. Uh, oh, there's a bird or something over there. Oh, I see. There's like a bird up there. Oh, that bird must be evil. It's <laughs> just because this is that. This is Poochie and Pansy. Uh, at an early age, Dream Axion's founder was immersed in a spiritual household. You mean like dark spirits? His parents exposed him to the belief systems of many cultures as they traveled the globe. Uh, he learned some religions. I'm actually a Christian. Uh, let's see, Islam, uh, Zoroastrian. I, I actually know about quite a few religions, but I have never heard this one. Zoroastrianism. Hmm. Uh, however, it was a belief system of the Australia. Oh, I don't like what the background shakes. Uh, let's see. Uh, the concept of dream time. Uh, blah, blah, blah. What is this? It's just nonsense. Well, it's not nonsense, but to me, it's nonsense. Uh, he believed it was axiomatic of nature himself. Blah, 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 blah. What does that have to do with Poochie and Pansy? The team. Oh, I wonder. Oh, is this the person that made Poochie and Pansy? Leon San Salvador. I saw him on the credits. He's a sensei. Uh, David, uh, oh, Dolts Entertainment. I remember that guy. Code Monkey. Uh, nothing weird here that I see. Dreams to paper, dreams to screen. The smoke signals? What? Melissa Ruse? Se semaphore smoke signals? I'm not sure what that means. Uh, projects. Poochie and Pansy. Um, Dream has, seeks to foster creativity, uh, blah, blah, blah. This is just, this is all normal stuff. I don't see anything weird. Uh, once considered the realm of child's play. Oh, like that Chucky movie or whatever. Games of all sorts we are accepted as not only fun for adults, but alternative forms of storytelling. Uh, what does this have to do with Poochie and Pansy? Blog. Um, oh, here's an update. Oh. Poochie and Pansy tagged. Uh, on January 26, 2020, that wasn't that long ago, at approximately 3.30, 3.30, a bad actor gained 
unauthorized access to the Poo Chimpanzee YouTube channel and upload and uploaded a video fraud. I know what this word is, but I can't s pronounce it. Fraudulently labeled as episode two HD remastered. Oh darn! So I missed it. Did he like? Did they remove it? Oh huh. Yeah, I don't really see anything interesting. I mean, like, it's kind of creepy, but there's nothing too weird. Oh, you can contact them! Uh, your name. Uh, let's see. Uh, no, I, I don't think I should. I don't want to bother them. I was going to, like, contact them and be like, Your series scared the daylight donuts out of me, and uh, my name is Zenshi, and you're a jerk. Okay, anyway. <gasps> there's a phone number. Oh, I'm not gonna do that. No way. No, I'm sorry, guys. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna call them. Oh, wait. What is this? What? What is this? Okay. I guess there's nothing else. Um. I honestly thought there'd be something creepy on the website, but I guess not. Um. It's not a secure website, though. Uh. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction of Poochie and Pansy Part One: The Quest for the Midnight Crown Remastered. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I hope you gamers continue to game on. God bless. If you like me, please subscribe, because I like you. Um, I hope there's more, uh, Poochie and Pansy Remastered. It'd be nice to see Part 2. Uh, I guess they deleted Part 2, HD Part 2 or whatever. Anyway, uh, I will see you guys soon. Bye bye Watch out for Poochie and Pansy, but apparently they turned over a new leaf, and now they're good guys! Yay? <laughs> So let's just game on. <laughs> game on. Game on. Let's 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 go. What the hurry? All right. Who's? Whoa. Blue. Sweet. Rams. Zenji. Ian. Rainbow. What? Whoa. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> Chainsaw. Jazz. Huh?